Well, this looks like the perfect setup. You've got enough room for two ATVs on a chassis that's high clearance, knobby tires, the whole nine yards. Hi, everybody. Welcome to the product review for At Your Leisure today. I'm Chad Booth. Now, I got to tell you, originally, I wasn't all that big of a fan of pop-up trailers. My sister bought one years and years ago, and it really wasn't anything more than a tent on wheels. Didn't really have any creature comforts to it, and I thought, if that's all there is, why don't you throw a tent in your car and a couple of air mattresses and you're done. But things have changed, and this Freedom Series from Rockwood is really impressive. The creature comforts will surprise you. Let's start with the outside galley. Now, I gotta tell you, when you go camping, part of the camping in the woods is cooking outdoors, and Rockwood has thought of that. I, I gotta tell you, more than once, I've been out, and even in an RV, no table, you end up like barbecuing on a rock. It's no fun. This is great though. It's built right into the trailer. There's a rail here. These brackets just pop on. You've got your barbecue and a prep table set up in just a matter of seconds. Really makes for great camping. They've thought it through. Now, let's take a look right here at the ATV storage area. Now, it's got a, it's got a rail all the way around. It's a really secure way to haul your ATVs. You run them across, but take a look at this. Undo a couple of pins and the side rail actually becomes your ramp to load the ATV, just like that. Now, take a look at this deck. There's some unique features here, too. First thing to check out are these great tie-downs. Not to only do you have one front and rear, but you've got them off to either side, so you can actually put four tie-downs on your ATV to really secure it well. It also gives you the option of hauling different kinds of cargo up here. But the thing I really like about it is the deck surface. Now the competition is running solid metal across here. It dents easily, it shows, and what do you do when your ATV is on the trailer, you're on your way home, you have to stop by the car wash and clean it off. You hose it off, where does all the mud go? On the deck. But with this mesh, all the dirt falls through and you can clean the ATVs right there on the spot and uh, the snow, mud, ice, gunk all goes away. It's a great feature really like it and it also doesn't show the dance. Okay, for all you guys that have a rotator cup problem, you know, ah, 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 look at this. Got a power switch right here to run your tongue jack. Makes hitching this thing up breeze, even with ATVs loaded. Come on. When we walk inside in just a minute, you're going to see a lot of space. Well, part of it is through this, not only is this just an end over end pop out trailer, but it has a slider in it as well which opens up the center of the cabin, gives you a lot of room. It's very comfortable in there. It's encased uh, with an exterior siding all the way around. It's very durable. And uh, of course, it's got all the creature comforts of home. You have a cable TV hookup, 30 amp plug-in power so you can uh, go into a campground and hook up. It also has a city water system on it. And it has an exterior wash down pump to clean off your ATVs as well as an outdoor shower, in case you're just like a little bit too dirty to go inside to clean up. When you come inside the XRT by Rockwood, first thing you're gonna notice is a lot of space. Some other things that you might not notice that are still noteworthy. Check out this. The liner on the top on the inside is metal. So say you're cooking something, you get a little grease up there, or the kids come in with dirty hands, it cleans up in a breeze which is a really great feature, and if you uh, have ever done ATVing, you know it's not exactly the cleanest sport in the world. But check out the bedding area back here. Now, not only does this have a furnace that heats the entire cabin, but also on those cold nights, these mattress covers are electric. You can plug them in, and it will heat the mattress pad so you're always toasty warm. You've got great great view, three sides all the way around your sleeping compartment, but you can also have privacy. Here's something I've never ever seen on a pop-up trailer before. Out in the tent area where the sleeping is, there's no light. And so if you want to read a book before you go to bed, you can't. But with the Rockwood, they've got these portable lights that plug into the hardwired lights on your roof, and it gives you lighting out in the sleeping areas. That is really cool. Now, this is probably my favorite part. Let's check out the galley right here. You have, of course, your three burner cooktop stove, hot and cold running water in your sink. But check this out. There's something that pop-up trailers don't have, a pantry. 
So you can put in all your canned goods and your uh, spices and things in an overhead shelf right here. And when you put the top down, you just simply unhook the pantry and store it away. The side benefit to this is that when you're preparing to go on your camping trip, instead of having to pack everything into a box, carry it out to the trailer, then pack the pantry, just take the pantry into the house and pack it up before you leave. It's got a zippered cover on it. This is a great feature. Now, here's another thing I really like. Most of the units have a flip over galley system in them, where it actually tips upside down and if you've got anything that's spilled on the stove or any water left in the sink, you have a mess on the floor. Check this one out. It comes up and over and down, stays level, and these two safety switches, when they come up, turn the power off in the whole trailer so you don't lose a battery or anything by leaving the lights on accidentally. Pretty cool, don't you think? Okay, now's the time where we do the head count. How many does it sleep? Well, these are extra long foldouts on this trailer. And they're plenty wide for a six foot tall guy to sleep across, which means you have room for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight in the convertible dinette, which has plenty of space for six people to dine in. Combine that with all of the low bench seating on the other side. This is a party trailer. Now, the one thing that makes it unique, the head. We have a complete bathroom system here. You have a built-in potty. You have a shower stall, tub and all, right down to the soap rack holder, and a shower. Lots of shower curtain. Goes all the way around. No peeking now. So there you have it, the grand tour. Now the XRT comes in a 28-foot model like this for two ATVs, or if you want something a little more compact, you can get the 23-foot model for a few shekels less that has room for one ATV. Cabin size is the same. And remember, these are backcountry approved with great wide high clearance. So if you want to take a look, the place to go to see the new Rockwood XRT series is Ray City RV in Roy.